This strategic move aims not only to combat imminent hunger, but also to reduce dependency on foreign imports. The central bank is leading by example in cultivating rice in a wheel, echoing President Salva Kiir Mayadi's call for increased agricultural productivity. After inaugurating the bank branch in a wheel, Bank Governor Dr. James Halich Garang visited the rice palm, demonstrating his commitment to this noble initiative. This work has just begun, and if anyone can see behind us, you see really that the work has been done. The two blocks that are remaining will be looked into, and hopefully when time comes, uh, especially next, next year, we will take those into account. It has been a pleasure seeing all of you here and coming for us to pay a visit to this uh, block, uh, demonstrating what the bank can do. It is our attempt as an institution to contribute to one of the key policy goals of this country, which is investing in local food production. The state government has allocated extensive land for the bank to expand its rice cultivation efforts. This initiative holds a significant objective and a policy focus in diversifying the economy. David Manuanak, Bank Director General for Administration and Finance, highlighted the importance of investing in agriculture, hedging the people of South Sudan to engage in production. Farming is not our mandate as a bank, but we also wanted to contribute to food supply uh, in our capacity. Uh, and that's why we have uh, come to see what progress has been made. This is one block among the three blocks that were given to the bank. There is block six and eight. And the consultant is also working on it. So by the time this uh, farm is finalized, we would see the fruit of the, of the exercise that we are undertaking. This year, the government of Northern Barak Gizal State alongside private individuals, have also joined in with extensive rice plantations. As for now, this year, uh, we want to put it as a trial and see the outcome of it. Say that next year, we will increase the production, and it will not only aim in northern Barak Kazar, uh, we shall extend it to all the various states where the branches of South, the Bank of South Sudan are. So as of today, uh, the governor, uh, Honorable Dr. James Alingara has visited the farm and he has seen for himself the work that uh, the team has done. And we are hoping that by, by next year the Bank of South Sudan will impact on full uh, production that they can uh, achieve two things. One, to stabilize the market. Rather than importing food from the neighboring countries, we have the capacity to produce our own food as a citizen of this country. So, based on 15 fear, I shall ask, maybe, uh, 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 and generate income from surplus food supplies. Daniel Marenwek, SSBC News, Awil.